Still carrying that, huh? Oh, you mean the lunchbox? Yeah. If you weren't gonna need it right away, you could have just left it with him back there. Teddy seems to have taken a real liking to you, Miss President. <laughs> I think I understand why. You're really pretty after all. Looking. Um, yes, I think so. I bet you'd look great if you dressed up. since I usually just wear what I need for work. But most people at school give their own little alterations to their uniforms and things like that. Is that allowed? Don't the teachers get sore? I'm not sure. I guess they might complain if things got too out of hand. But I wear a cardigan over my uniform all the time, and I've never received a complaint. Let's see. I wonder what kind of look would work for you. Like that. See? Isn't it fun to give your uniform your own personal touch? I never gave much thought to fashion, though. I think Chie would be better at telling which colors complement you best. Chie? Who's she? She's a great friend of mine. Chie is a natural at choosing colors and things that look great on people. A friend of yours? I want to meet her, too. Sure. Once this is over, we can all go shopping together. I'm sure there are lots of outfits that would look good on you. Yeah. Let's do that. I'll hold you to it.
Chan? She's making contact through her persona, so it must be. Senpai! Thank goodness! Sorry, I was so relieved that I started tearing up. Are you alright, Yukiko Senpai? Mm hmm. I'm fine. What about you? Are you okay? You were doing these weird broadcasts until a moment ago, but you're back to normal now, right? That wasn't me! A fake teddy was saying those things in my voice! Ever since I got kidnapped, he was watching me. I didn't get any chances to use my persona. Yukiko-senpai, where are you right? Hmm? Wait a sec. Are you with someone right now? Weird. Something's not right about her. I can't put my finger on it, but she's not normal. Based on how things went last year, you think that girl's the victim and the fake Teddy's her shadow? I don't know yet, but it's possible. Risei-chan, you say you were with the fake one all this time. Are you okay? Oh sure, don't worry about me. The fake's gone off somewhere. That's why I was trying to contact someone. Oh, this might not be worth mentioning now, but your manager called me in. Huh? Inoue-san Inoue contacted, contacted you? you? Yikes. Yikes! Sorry about that. Oh no, don't be. I just thought you should know. Oh man, how am I gonna explain this? I seriously have no excuse. I'll just have to lie and say I ran away from home for a few days. I'm gonna get in such trouble for this. Oh. But one thing at a time. We have to deal with this situation first. Don't worry, the others are here too. We'll rescue you in no time. Yeah, I'm sensing them now. Cool. I'll be waiting, so hurry and come get me. Oh, but be careful. Well, that didn't look weird or nothing. Were you talking to your friend inside your head? Oh, yes. Sorry. I bet it's hard to believe, but... Nah, I could tell from watching you. You didn't look like you were faking it. You must really get along with him. Huh? I could see on your face that you didn't doubt him at all. And I'm sure they trust you right back, huh? <laughs> they sure do. We've been through a lot together, you see. Hmm. Don't worry, we're behind you too. 
I'm sure you'll get through this just fine. Senpai, you came! There's no point in pretending to be Teddy anymore. I'm not fooled. Who are you? Why are you doing this? How much longer will this awful game continue? Oh my! How rude of you to call it awful when you're the ones who wished for it! We wished for this? What do you mean? Ha 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 ha! As I've said from the start, real men let their fists do the talking! Bring up the next challenger! I had a feeling it would be you. That makes things easier then. Let's get started, Yukiko. If it's at all possible, I don't want to fight. Can we not do this? What a question. You've been fighting against your friends this whole time, haven't you? That's true, but... Huh. <laughs> I don't want to fight, huh? You always just wait for things to happen. You won't... You can't do anything until someone makes the choice for you. You haven't changed at all. Just like last year, you're still waiting for someone to come and rescue you. I haven't changed at all? It's not true. I'm trying to the best of my abilities. Enough with the weasel words. I'm sick of your excuses. Let's 
Listen, both of you, something ain't right. Yukiko-san, are you really gonna fight him? I'm sorry, I know you want to stop this, but this is my only choice right now. Please, stand back, Miss President. 